why George Clooney and wife Amal keep their children so private. The actor has spoken publicly about his decision. Arguably one of the most famous actors in the world, George Clooney and his wife Amal are never too far from the glare of the spotlight, but have you ever wondered why you've never their children's faces before? The Descendants star, 60, has chosen to keep his children Alexander and Ella completely private in order to not put their lives in jeopardy. The actor previously penned an open letter to all media outlets, asking them not to publish the faces of their twins, now four. The actor penned an open letter to all media outlets, asking them not to publish the faces of their twins, Alexander and Ella. The letter includes the words, I am a public figure and accept the oftentimes intrusive photos as part of the price to pay for doing my job. Our children have made no such commitment. The nature of my wife's work has her confronting and putting on trial terrorist groups and we take as much precaution as we can to keep our family safe. We cannot protect our children if any publication puts their faces on their cover. We have never sold a picture of our kids, we are not on social media and never post pictures because to do so would put their lives in jeopardy. Not paranoid jeopardy but real world issues, with real world consequences. We hope that you would agree that the need to sell advertisement isn't greater than the need to keep innocent children from being targeted. Thank you, George Clooney. George and Amal Clooney welcomed their twins in 2017 after tying the knot in 2014. During an interview with today's Hoda Kotb, George was quizzed on whether he regrets having children in later life. He replied, There are some people, their goal was, I have to have children. Mine wasn't. I wasn't looking at life, going, my life will be unfulfilled without children. I felt like I had a pretty full life. Then I met Amal and realized that my life had been pretty empty. And then we throw these two kids in there and suddenly you realize how incredibly empty it was and, you know, it fills it all up. It makes it fun.
Their goal was, I have to have children. Mine wasn't. I wasn't looking at life, going, my life will be unfulfilled without children. I felt like I had a pretty full life. Then I met Amal and realized that my life had been pretty empty. And then we throw these two kids in there and suddenly you realize how incredibly empty it was and, you know, it fills it all up. It makes it fun.